Hey guys, what's up? Jason Andrews, AKA the All-American Driver, and this is a little bit depressing. So, you guys know, um, you know, the dealership, you know, they did all that work, they put new cam phasers in the truck and everything. Well, I've had it back a couple days. I put the 10 on there. We were about to take off for an adventure, and the check engine light came back on. So I don't really know what the problem is. I just I just don't know. I don't know. Um, I texted the dealership. Obviously they were like confused and well, whatever, annoyed at the situation too. Not at me, but you know, like, well, wow, crap, the truck is you know is not fixed or whatever. So that kind of sucks. Anyways, we're gonna make the best of it. We are going to set up camp here at home. Hey, babe, you excited to camp? So we have our fire pit here, I'm going to chop some wood, we uh, ordered takeout and actually they also gave us drinks to go. Let me bring them. What did we get? Let me bring them. Hold She's going to bring them. In the meantime, you guys remember a couple episodes ago, Andrea got that big shipment of uh, stone in. Well, I finally... Um, Hook that thing up so now we have like a little castle around this tree. It's like a planter slash retainer wall. We still need to fill it up with rocks and then soil and then moss. It's not completely done, but the wall portion is done. <laughs> what are these drinks called? Cheers. They are called Dangerous Dave. Dangerous Dave, and where did no we get these? Dave here. Dave, if you're out there, where, you create this. where did we get these? We got them from Blazing Onion. Yeah, a nice little burger joint. So we got burgers. I'm eating meat tonight. I've we, been a vegetarian for a while. We but still need to. Meat, we them. still need to set up the tent and. Um, Get some food out and also make a fire. So we're going to get to work. All right, so we uh, got the fire done. Uh, maybe have a quick drink and then we got to set the tent up. I think we have room to clear in there. I think we're both a little bit hungry and then the check engine light was just uh, like a depressing, devastating blow. Uh, to the weekend So our dogs, you know, they like to jump and uh, catch snowflakes and rain and things but uh, They also like to jump and catch uh, Ambers from the fire I'm not really sure why they do that. Did you see? Say it again, just the slow motion part. Yeah, they're very special. Stop it, Mike! We have to eat. You ready to eat? Oh yeah. I've been waiting for hours. Nom nom nom. Okay, so I know I haven't given a full um, description of how I have the tent on and actually what tent I'm running. So, 
Obviously, you guys know this is my 2013 Ford Raptor. We have the front runner slimline roof rack. Okay. We have a Tepui ruggedized uh, three person tent, which I'm about to open. And if you guys can see in here, uh, we have these little brackets that we were able to mount with. Let me see if I can see. Yeah, see up here. So that's the only way we, I was able to mount this uh, tent to uh, the front runner roof rack. And then also, uh, you guys know I have the Retrax XR Pro uh, tonneau cover, which allows me to slide this basically anywhere uh, that I want and lock it into place. Uh, really happy with this setup. Unfortunately, um, the truck isn't running that good right now, so I don't really feel confident taking it somewhere super adventurous, which is why we're camping at home. So, I will now open up this tent. It's a zoom lens too, if you want to dramatically... How's it going up there? So obviously we could prop this one open like the side ones, but we would just have a view of the street, which we don't want. We want a little bit of privacy here tonight. You can see So we're kind of tucked away under this tree. We do have skylights up at the top though, so it's not like we're just completely blocked out from that. We do have this side open, but then you guys can see like complete like mono roof up there. We Try still care again. We still need some bedding. We're not gonna bedding, we have sleeping bags. Oh yeah, we have sleeping bags. Thanks, babe. What are you doing? Taking an, an Instagram banger? Yeah. Just a picture. Yeah. Maybe banger, might not, might be a binger. Bingor, binger, banger. What's for dessert, babe? I had some s'mores. S'mores. Lock in the door? Yeah, I'm locking the door. Good? You have keys? Yeah. So the fire's out. Zerg, he's ready. Kerrigan, you're ready. Mom, ready. We got the tent here. We're actually by a, um, a motion light. Stay there. 
It's about 10.30 tonight. You can see we got our two sleeping bags. We got some pillows back there. We got a blanket for the dogs. Um, now from the street though, I mean you really can't tell anything. Obviously it's dark out here. The moon looks nice. So this is it. We're really just really roughing it out here. Right, babe? Yeah. Really just connecting with nature and... Show the tree though. It's pretty. Yeah, I know it's pretty. I showed it. I mean, I feel out in the nature. Yeah, this is what we got for tonight. Before anyone asks, what I'm going to do with uh, Zerg and Kerrigan. Basically, we're going to pick them up and we're going to put them in the tent with us. Oh, yeah. Right? Yeah. Yep. Yeah, they're coming with us. All right, you ready? Yeah. They always get the special treatments. Special treatments. Yeah, they're spoiled. Yeah. Say goodnight. Good night. So you could say we had um, an eventful night. Um, however, the, the sounds of thunder and lightning um, early this morning uh, triggered us to uh, put up the tent while we're in the, the shelter of our own home right now. So, So that's it. I actually had an idea for the truck, but I can't work on it right now because it's raining. Um, but as soon as it gets dry, I'm going to uh, get to work. 